Bonjour and welcome to another Alexis review. I hope you're all fine and today we will be talking about Brass Button by uh, Matthew Wright and Mark Southworth. Uh, actually, I, I used to talk a little bit with uh, Mark de, on uh, Facebook and I heard that he passed away uh, recently. So uh, all my thoughts are with uh, his family because uh, he was one of the best guy in magic and he was one of the greatest mind in magic too. So I, I really think about uh, his family right now. Sorry for the start of the video, it's a little bit uh, not fun, but it's important. Uh, so what is Brass Button? Brass Button is a copper silver brass, uh, a very common plot in coin magic, but adapted to uh, different objects, such as I will show you. Uh, so this is the gimmick. <laughs> so you get this little thing, which is not a poker chip, actually. It's like a medal you get when you win at poker. Uh, tournament, but you can also use it, I think, as a dealer button. You get a washer, which is like a, a rusted piece of metal, and you get a button. The interesting part is that the button is made out of metal, so it's very sturdy and allow you to perform very interesting coin magic move with the sound uh, uh, with it. And of course, you also get uh, the gimmick, which allow you to perform the copper silver brass routine, but I will show you in the unboxing. Basically, all the routine of copper silver brass you can think of, you would be able to perform them with brass button. Brass button is sold at, I think, 50 to 60 euros in France. Uh, if you want to buy it, feel free to go into the, the bio. I put a link to a selected shop that help my reviews. So if you want to support my review, feel free to buy your unit uh, using the link in the description. So what do you get? Actually, you get, of course, this little box. Um, inside, you'll get the link for an explanation video, which is roughly two hours long, I think. And there is the explanation by Matthew Wright. And then a few creators go and um, show their routine with the brass button. So you have Craig Petty, Xavier, uh, Javier Fuenmayer. You have a lot of magician, top-notch magician that explains their routine with it, which is, I think, actually amazing. And um, of course, you get the little props, as I showed. So you get those three items that are regular ones. And you get the gimmick, which is um, this one. I will try not to. So you get the, the, the same, uh, like, poker tournament thing, uh, like a, a poker chip. We will say poker chip, even if it's not a poker chip. And of course, when you use the gimmick, you can also show the button and the washer. So the gimmick is very well made out of metal and I, I really like how it looks once it's, uh, it's, it's very clean. Actually, it's very, very clean. And um, I love the fact that they were able to produce a high quality item because uh, those kind of packagings are usually made uh, in India or China. And uh, actually, they, they produce a very, very high quality set of, uh, of units. So, I really like what they've done with it and the price is correctly set. I don't think it's, uh, I think it's too low. I would have paid like a hundred bucks for this one actually because it's very, very sturdy, very, the quality is very good. The explanations are amazing. I don't know what else you want from a, a product. It's actually one of the, one of the best, I can say, product I've seen in 2023. A little demonstration, it's very basic, but you get the idea. So you have got the button, I've got the washer, and I've got the little, uh, how do you say, the poker chip, let's say poker chip. Uh, while placing them in my hand, what do you want? The poker chip, you want the washer, you want the button? You ask, you, you tell, the, 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 the poker chip? Okay, so this is the poker chip. The idea is that if you take the poker chip and rub it against the back of your hand, just like this, you can just blow, and then you have the washer, 
and the button. And when you open your hand, of course, there is the little uh, poker chip in your hand. Uh, you can go uh, even further and say, uh, those are very basic moves I, I perform, but I want you to understand what could be, uh, what you can achieve with them. So for example, I take this time, uh, oh no, I, I still take the poker chip. I put it in my pocket. So what I, do I have left in my hand? Uh, the washer and the button? No, actually I, I still have the poker chip. So maybe you think that in my pocket I have the button and the, the washer. No, the button and the washer are there because the, the little poker chip just fly back to my pocket. So very basic, very, very basic, but you get uh, the idea of what you can perform with it. And on top of that, if you just uh, plug in like a little quiver, for example, uh, you, you can perform a lot of uh, very interesting thing, I think, with it so that the item can be examined, check out at the beginning and just came back to the quiver at the end. But um, I hope that you liked this little demonstration. So let's go into the cons. I have two cons. Well, I will put back the, the little light because it's more interesting with that. The, the first con is that if you're used to uh, handling like coin magic or basic coin, you will be a little bit surprised by the thickness. Uh, I, I, it's not a problem because it doesn't look odd, but when you're handling the coins, they're a, little, they're a little bit thick, so you have to adapt a little bit uh, the, 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 the manipulation you are uh, used to because it's a little bit thicker. The other and only con I can see is that uh, in general uh, copper, silver, brass gimmick, the, the coin is a Chinese coin. And the Chinese coin, however its orientation, will fit with the, with the gimmick. Here, since the, and I think it's the strength of the product, since there is a button, the button is not always the same. The hole won't uh, always match, if I can say that. So you have to fiddle a little bit around with the gimmick. Nothing complicated, and you will get used to it very, oh, very, very quickly. But I wanted to mention that because uh, it's not as you know how to use a, a copper silver brass, you will know how to use brass button. There is a little bit like maybe an hour to get used to the new gimmick, in not even an hour, and uh, it will be uh, perfect. But just to mention that, and I had to find uh, some cons because this product is amazing. So sorry for that. <laughs> Let's go into the pros. As I said, I love uh, the copper silver brass routine, but I always found, found the thing not, uh, not entertaining, not, it didn't have a sense, a, a meaning. I, I find it meaningless, I think that's the word in English. Uh, so the idea of using this kind of product is, in my opinion, genius. Why, you would ask? Because um, those are items that you can fi find, you know, in, the, in those little biscuit box uh, my mom had in drawer, y you never found biscuits in them, you find buttons and weird stuff and washers and needle and spools of threads and I really like the fact that I can relate it to my own experience because I think magic should be part of, of that and uh, people know that the quality street box you know never any quality street inside just random bits of stuff and I think it's a great starting point for the routine so I love that and of course, as I said, the fact that uh, a washer and a button, so the color is different, the size is different, the structure is different from this one. So I love the fact that those two can become this one and this one can become those two. I, I really found that this is a, a very, very clever way of, I think it's more fooling than a, a regular copper silver brass and the, the objects have more meaning. So. <laughs> it's just twice as better as, a, well, fourth as better as a copper silver brass. I already said that the products were amazing in terms of quality, the teaching is great. This is, uh, as I said, one of my best purchases of 2023 and I, uh, I really encourage you to check it out. Uh, I really like what uh, Matthew Wright and uh, Mark Southworth did with this one and uh, it's, di it's directly going into my, my close-up case. I love it. I, I really love it. So it's four art out of four. As for the difficulty, um, as I said, you have to get used to the gimmick, but not much. So I think that would be a two stars out of four.
Similar products, you can of course check out any copper silver brass uh, product or routine on the market you like. Feel free to let me know your favorite one in the comment. The video is now finished. Thank you so much for watching it. I hope you liked it. Uh, I had a blast shooting it because the product is amazing. So yes, feel free to, to let me know what other kind of product you would like me to see review you would you would like me to review that's the better way of saying it and sorry for my english again see you soon in another alexis review au revoir